Hi there beautiful Thrivers, welcome back to another video with Thriving in Chaos. Today we're going to be cash stuffing our modus paycheck. So thank you guys for being here, click that subscribe button, like the video, and let's go. Hi everyone, I hope you guys are doing good. Today I have just a little cash stuffing, just a small one to do with you guys. It is our modus cash stuffing and if you're not sure what modus is, it is basically a transportation reimbursement program my husband's company participates in. Basically, in a nutshell, they pay for his car and they pay per mile that he drives for work. So it does things like paying for the vehicle that he uses for work and I like to use some of it to put away for specifically car related things and then stuff whatever is left. So that is what we're going to be doing today. But before we do that, let me go ahead and grab today's prompt -a card. If you're new to my videos, this is a prompt -a card. It's basically a conversation starter. So I'll ask and answer the question on the card in this video, and you guys can put your answers in the comments below. Just a little something to help us get to know each other better. So today's prompt -a card is, what food do you hate? I'm going to have to say it is asparagus. I have tried to eat asparagus in 20 different ways and fashions, including fried and baked and breaded and all of that, and it's just not happening. I cannot get behind the taste of asparagus. <laughs> so that is a food that I absolutely hate. But what about you guys? Let me know in the comments below. What food do you hate? So today we are going to be cash stuffing our modus paycheck, which I consider to be paycheck number three. It was $1,247.30. So of course I left the change in the account, which leaves us $1,247. 888 of that is our truck payment. So I just left that in the bank. So it's ready to go for that payment to come out which leaves $359, which will stuff in all of these and all of these. Yeah, that's a hot mess, but I can read it, trust. So we're gonna be doing that in this video today. So here is that money. This is just the remainder after the truck payment. It should be $359, so 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 240, 250, 255, 65, 75, 85, 95, 300, 510, 1520, 535, 450, 355, 356, 7, 8, and 359. So now I'm going to start with my living expenses binder. We're not putting anything in groceries or dining out or gas, but we will be putting some in extra toiletries. We're going to do $5. So now we have $60 in there. Home is going to get five as well. So now it has 20, 35, and 40. Pets is going to get five. So now it has 25, 35. For self care, we're going to add five and I'm going to just put it into haircuts. So we have 10, 15, 20, 25 dollars in haircuts. We have 65 in hair color and 40 in nails. For gifts, we're going to add 5, so that is 20, 35, 45 there. For clothing, also adding 5. So now we have 100, 20, 40, 145, and 150 in clothes. For family fun, adding 5. So now we have 10 in there. Just going to rebuild this. Date night also getting five, so now it has ten.
gaming is going to get the last four, I think, of our budget. So one, two, three, and four, I think. Yeah, four. So the last four of the budget goes into here. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen now in gaming. School supplies, I am skipping it this time. Um, electronics, though, is going to get five. So now it has 100, 20, 35, 45, 145. Amazon, I'm skipping. Peach Pass, I'm going to put 40 in. So 20, 40 for that. So now it has 60. Miscellaneous is going to get 5. So now it has 20, 5, 30, $5 in there. And Cost of Living is going to get 30, which is a tank of gas. So now it has $130. And we are done with this binder. Now moving over to my memories binder. Starting with hubby, we're not going to stuff. Wifey, not going to stuff. Birthdays, not going to stuff. But holidays, actually I think I'm skipping that one as well. Vacation, I am putting $10 in. We've been working on food. So $10 into there makes this 50, 100, 10, 25, 125. I'm not sure how high up I need this to be. Probably not too, too high. Road trip, we're going to add five. So it has 20, 45, 55 in there. Anniversary is going to get five, so it has 120, 35, 40. Grad party, I'm not going to stuff with this. Christmas, I am for $20, so I'm putting that in my son's tab. Adding the 20 in, we have 150, 70, 90, 1, 210. So 210, we only have $90 to go to meet that requirement and I did forget somebody did comment in the last video that I forgot to check that off you were right so we'll check off last cash stuffing right there and this cash stuffing right on schedule moving over to my life maintenance binder starting with health savings I'm putting $100 into health it needs it. I'm just going to put that right into medicine probably. It's got five dollars in there so a hundred and five. Mental health, I don't stuff with this paycheck. For car maintenance, I'm going to put fifty dollars in here and I think I'm going to put that right into probably oil changes. We'll count this in another video because I don't feel like it right now. Um, home, I'm going to add five. So clearly all these are going to get five. So home, five. Home reno is getting five. Both of these were empty. Vet bill is getting five. So now it has 15. Done with this binder. Now in our savings. For mine and my hubby savings, we do five. So 50, 70, 90, $95 there. We're just building this back up. If you know, you know. Hubby, I mean hubby. My son's, my son's is getting five. So now he and the rest of them will have five, six, seven, eight hundred, fifty, seventy, ninety, ninety-five, nine hundred and five dollars. And then adding five into the rest will make them all nine hundred and five dollars, which is awesome. Almost got these back up to a thousand. Retirement is going to get five. 
now it has 120, 40, 45, and 150. And emergency fund is getting this last five. So now it has 125 and 130. And as you can see, we have stuffed everything. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's just a small little cash stuffing. I love to have the small ones every once in a while, especially when I'm out there planting a garden. So I need to go and plant the last bit of my seeds, which are watermelon and cantaloupe and lots of different types of peppers. So I'm looking forward to doing that. If you guys want to be updated on my garden, feel free to let me know in the comments. Otherwise, if you're still watching and you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love to be your weekly inspiration for your own budgeting journey. And with that being said, I'll see you next week. Have a great weekend. And as always, until next time, bye.